Hey, John Cristani here, and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how you can advertise dentists and get paid as much as $300 a month. And if you're a dentist and you found this page, congratulations. I'm gonna show you step by step by step how to set up Google ads that are going to get you clients for your business. And if you're a marketer, you're fortunate because I'm gonna show you how you can work with dentists around the world and get paid to set up their ads. And you're gonna have everything you need from this video step by step by step to actually go out there and start earning money and charging for this new skill that you're gonna learn in this video. So if you're excited to learn something new, if you're a bit confused and frustrated when you're doing internet work and you're looking for something that's step by step, give this video a big like, subscribe, and prepare for some sick content. Let's go. This is a little bit of a different video. I'd love your feedback on how you like this because I'm gonna go deep and I'm gonna be showing you some skills here of how to make things happen in advertising land. Now, the first step is you need to, uh, you know, go to Google Ads, right? And you just click the sign in button up there and you will be in. And here we go over to the campaign screen. You'll see it'll look something, something like this. You know, Google has different screens for different people, but you either want to select this blue plus button or just select the new campaign button to set up the ads for dentists. Now I'm going to go through this and after this, I'm going to show you how to find dentists to be your clients and how to collect money. So first we want to set up a new campaign and we really want to focus on create a campaign without guidance. Now, the next thing is we want to do, we want to focus this on search. So we're going to select search and we're going to focus on phone calls. Okay. For this example, I'm just going to use a random dentist, uh, just Malibu Dental Group right here. I'm just going to copy their phone number, just using them in our example. So then we're going to click continue and we will start moving forward. Now what you enter as a campaign name, it doesn't matter. You can misspell this all you want. It won't really affect, it won't affect anything in your ad. But what you do want to do is you want to get rid of display network because uh, you want to target it a different way. Leave the search network. Search network are sites like AOL.com and other partners. Now, an important thing here is the actual location options. So you want to actually enter in a location and you want to click this button that says advanced search right there. Now within advanced search, you want to select radius targeting right there. And in our case, we're going after Malibu. Now you also want to set a radius that you're willing to advertise in. You generally speaking for a dentist, 10 miles is going to be a good sight, good range of locations, especially in Malibu. You know, we can zoom in on the map and kind of get an idea. Okay, yes, we're hitting Western Malibu. We're hitting Eastern Malibu. We're hitting the mountainous areas kind of around where I live in there. And we're hitting some of the nice communities around. So we'll click save right there. English is good. And then we want to set a daily budget. Now, generally speaking, $1,000 a month is a good budget for any business um, to advertise. And in this case, we want to select a bid strategy directly. We want to select maximize clicks because most local business owners don't have conversion pixels and optimized websites for taking leads in. Generally marketers do, um, but not actual dentists, right? We can select more options here, but we don't really need to care about any of those. Okay. So then we just click continue. Next step, again, it doesn't matter what you enter in here. This can all be mixed and matched, but we're gonna go back to our dentist example and we're going to use this person's website, right? Malibu Dental Group. We're just gonna copy that, in this case, their website. Now for dentists and dental stuff, you, when you're doing location targeting, the location targeting is most important. The keyword targeting is not as important. So what we're going to do here is we're going to just select a few keywords, dentist, dental, and I'm going to show you why we are copying and pasting these words 
multiple times. Anybody who's having problems with their teeth, if it's within a 10 mile radius, it's fairly targeted. So here we're gonna add in some brackets. This is called exact match um, within Google. And this gives us another layer of optimization to allow us to target. Now, in this case, we're not gonna use teeth in exact match. We want it in phrase match only, okay? And that's what the quotations are, is phrase match. As you see, we have dentist and fray, exact phrase and broad match. Same thing with dental. Let's save and continue. Now here's the next step. Sometimes Google suggests some headlines for us based on the website. In our case, we're just going to actually use, use some ad copy. Great value, great dentist. Now I'm putting this in quotations because most human beings look for external validation in order to select a service they're working with. Um, so putting it in quotations makes it appear like it's a quote from somebody um, without actually quoting somebody. Best dentist in Malibu. My kids teeth look great. So right here, I just used some basic ad copy. I found some other folks using from around the internet. You can't get, none of this is gonna be like copyrighted like material. So we're just gonna click save and continue, and we're gonna see if there are any errors here. So we have one error, so we just click fix it. And the final URL, oh, we forgot to use the URL here, and we just enter that in, okay? Say, and then we click done, and we click save and continue. Let's see if there are any other errors that are going on here. One error, punctuation and symbols. Okay, so we can't use too much punctuation and symbols. And in this case, we're gonna delete the exclamation mark. Oh, and I guess this is the problem. Okay, now we set up our campaign here, but there's one thing we wanna change, which is gonna get us a lot of better results um, for dentists. Most people don't have high converting websites. I mean, it really takes advanced marketers to do that. But once we're in the campaign, we wanna go down here and you can see kind of slide down here and you'll see there's this more button. It's kind of hidden, right? Kind of hide these things. And we click more and then we can go down here to select for devices, okay? We have some important things here. We have devices and we also have ad schedule. These are really important if you're running a local business and you want to see results. Um, do you want people contacting you outside your business hours? Probably not. Okay, now we're gonna click in devices right here. And what we wanna do is we actually want to select a bit adjustments for mobile computer, for computers and tablets. And to get a local business, if you're a dentist, the best results is you wanna put a neck decrease the bid by 100%, okay? Now remember, most of your advertising probably isn't being tracked, so you're not really losing out on much. And also, you, you're just gonna waste money on desktop um, if you don't have a high converting website. With a mobile phone, you have the opportunity, you're hitting 85% of the market and you're getting them to call you. Well, what good is that if they're calling you outside of business hours, okay? We're gonna go into the ad schedule right here and I'm gonna change the ad schedule to whatever whatever it is that the actual ad schedule is, the schedule is for your company, right? So we go down here and we click edit ad schedule. And this is, allows us to say that we are open maybe Monday through Friday from, you know, 8.30 to, you know, 6.30, right? Uh, whatever your business hours are, you want to click save right here. A lot of businesses don't do this. Start time. Oh, oopsies. So now, look at that. Folks, look at this for a second. The typical business is open five days a week, business hours. Look at all this junk. Now, I've worked with over 10,000 local businesses, and what I've seen is that you know, of course you can have lead forms, you can have voicemail, but a lot of the customers that come in and click on ads outside of business hours don't get responded to. It's just a sad fact of um, running a business. 
You want customers calling you during your business hours. That's gonna be where you create your most effective advertising. So do this, and there we go. Now we can go back to our campaign, look at our ads if you want, but really that's all we need to do at this point and we are set up. Now you might be wondering, John, how do I make money? How do I reach, how do I find dentists who wanna pay me money uh, to set up their ads for them to help them get new business? Well, first off, have you ever used a dentist before? Chances are, if you live in America or Western country, you've seen a dentist before. Contact them, ask them if they'd be interested in having their ads set up, let them know that you recently learned how to set up ads for a dentist and you are interested in setting up their ads for free even, or just for a minimal expense. It doesn't matter, just let them know. As a customer, you've already been there. You can reach out to them and you can ask them very simple questions like that. Another way is using our software, Marketing Tech. Now, you see Marketing Tech, when we log in, I'm gonna switch the screen right back here. When you're logged in as a client, you can actually find clients through our software, okay? And if you wanna sign up for Marketing Tech, Marketing Tech is free to sign up for and we give every user free credits to actually go and find local businesses, okay? You can get started for free as an agent. And I'm gonna show you how to get paid as well, okay? And we have get started right up here. Now, in our client finder, you can go in here and you can click find a client right there. And here, we're just gonna click search for clients right there. Let's say we wanna find dentists, right? Dentists in Malibu. Then we just click search. Make this kind of big so y'all can see it nice. And we get a number of different dentists showing up right here, Malibu Dental Group. And we can click this, we can click any one of these and unlock their contact info to contact them. Let's go. As you see here, we have, you know, some of this information is public, but we also have their other websites. We have his Facebook page, Bob Perkins, it looks like, phone number, business info. Okay, we have a lot of information here and we have multiple ways we can contact this, this Bob Perkins character right here. Okay, so here's how you can find clients and leads. You can find lots of different people's information right here through our lead finder. And uh, once you're signed up to Marketing Tech, you get five credits for free. Okay, just so we, you can see how it works. Now, if you actually want to sign up clients for, if you actually want to handle their advertising for them and get paid, one method is you can just ask them to pay you via Venmo or PayPal or something like that. But an easier method is actually to use our software and have not only our software take the payment for you, but have our software do the marketing and do the work that I just showed you for you. So literally, all of the work is done for you. And here is an example of the landing page you get when you sign up for Marketing Tech. This is actually our CTO and he's uh, one of our examples here. And you just send him this page and you sit and it will have your local information and you just click. When the business owner gets on, they just, they'll just sign in. They'll just start, they'll log in, they'll create an account, they'll create an account and they'll get to see a actual preview of how their ads show up. As you see, our tool, our software, automatically figures out where advertising is placed. All we need is a few pieces of information and we can set up all the ads, do all of the settings, just like it would be in Google Ads, except we're not just setting up Google Ads for these folks, we're setting up we're setting up all the ads, Facebook, Google, and Instagram. And you see, we work with a ton of different local businesses. We have vegan restaurants, we do videos for all of these businesses, and we customize all of the videos for these local businesses. Marketing Tech will take payment for you 
as you see, when, when the local business owner selects how many people they would like to view their ad. And we have a very high converting form, high converting website right here that will take their payment info. Okay, and if you are a dentist, I have a link where you can sign up for us to handle your marketing for you. Thanks for watching. I hope you got some value from this video, seeing step-by-step step how to set up some Google Ads. Um, Google Ads is a very powerful and complex tool. It, is a made, it has made me tens of millions of dollars by being able to personally run a business where I advertise and I make money. And when you figure out the equation of spending a dollar to make back two, three, four, five, then you figured out the way to wealth. And you, this can be, happen for any business, whether you're a dentist, whether you're a marketer, whether you are um, any sort of local business owner. Spend a dollar, get more customers in. All you need is a thousand dollars a month to spend and you, your business can be broadcast to everyone in your local area and you can get new customers coming in like clockwork. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a good day. All the best.